this is today's lesson. This is day nine, but we're actually going to make this day 10 because there was accidentally two eights. So this one is going to be now day 10. Okay, so for today you have this math worksheet to do and you need to finish your story. That means you need to have a story with a sentence about your characters and setting. You need to have a sentence about your problem and you need to have a sentence about your solution. So your story should be at least three sentences. That means that I want more. I want four or five or six or more sentences. Um, and the story you created yesterday is based off of the characters and setting problem and solution you made. So today you are finishing your story, you're adding lots of detail, and you're adding lots of detail to your illustration today. And I need to see a picture of your illustration and your story. So for math, we have one of our number sprints here. So I'll do a few with you. So let's see. Um, the first one is 10 plus two. Don't forget to make sure you're really looking at our symbols here to make sure you're doing the right operation. This is addition. This whole page happens to be addition, but sometimes it's mixed, so you have to really look at it. Okay, so this one is 10 plus two. Well, I know if I start at 10 and I count on two more, 10, 11, 12, and my answer is 12. Hmm. Pick a couple little other ones to do with you. Oh, I know. I'll do number 24 down here. This one is written a little differently. You are not finding the total anymore. You're finding the part. One of the parts is missing. So 12 plus something equals 14. So we need to figure out how to get from 12 to 14. So I'm going to count on. I'm gonna start at 12, then I'm gonna count 13, 14. So how many did I need to get to 14? Two. So 12 plus two equals 14. Um, I'll do one more, I'll do the next one with you. Number 25 is 12 plus blank equals 15. So same thing, I have to start at 12 and I need to figure out how we're gonna get to 15. So 12, 13, 14, 15, three. Um, I'll do one more, I'll do this bottom one with you. Number 30, four plus blank equals 36. Now four and 36 are not really near each other. So I'm actually going to count down for this one. I'm going to start at 36 and I'm going to count down four because our number is four. So 36, 35, 33, oops, sorry. 36, 35, 34, 33, 32. Okay, so now let's put that together to make sure. Let's check our work. 32 and four more. So 32, 33, 34, 35, 36. So that's how you can do these that have higher numbers. So make sure you take a picture of your completed math work and you need to finish writing your story. You need to include your characters and setting. That should be at least one sentence, if not more. Your problem should be a sentence and your solution should be a sentence. So I should have one, two, three, or more. At this point in the school year, we're really counting on the more sentences. I should have a story with maybe five or six sentences in it, okay? All right, I look forward to seeing the pictures of your work.